Hey guys, Russ from Willie's Firewood here. It is Wednesday afternoon. We are kind of at a standstill right now. We've got the dump truck and the dump trailer both down waiting on parts. I'll kind of take you around, show you what we got going on with the dump truck. Dump trailer is waiting on a pump, um, but we'll give you an update on what we got going on in the wood yard. I'll get some help from a special helper. Uh, we'll do a few other odds and ends as we go too, but stay tuned. So Richard wants to ride his go-kart. Gramps been cutting. There's all kinds of rounds that we're gonna put over here. I'm dirty and I'll show you why in a minute. But how long do you think this is gonna take us, Richard? Um, um, 10, he says 10 to 15 minutes. So I'm gonna shut this off and I'm gonna help him because misery loves company. And we'll come back in just a few minutes and we'll let you know how long it actually took us. So, 12 minutes later, we are all done. Now what's it time to do? Uh, time to go-kart ride. Time to go-kart ride. All right, let's go fire up Richard's Lamborghini. And now he is one happy little boy. If you wanna play, you gotta work. That's what we're teaching them. A little hard work never hurt anybody, and you get to play after. Work hard, play harder. He's just inspecting the mud puddle to see what he can make for a mess. <laughs> so I had dirty hands because we zoom in. The Lamborghini uh, down here. We have the axles loosened, we have the calipers off. We are going to be changing the rotors on this and side. on this side. This side here, you can see the rotor is very bad. It was making noise, we tried to hold off as long as we could, trying to get everything done for the holiday rush, but ended up breaking a brake pad, blowing a caliper in the process, so that put us down. Still waiting on parts that were supposed to be delivered this morning. It's just typical. In the seat, we have two brand new calipers with the hardware back in the corner, ready to go. We're waiting on pads and rotors. We'll get this put back together. Um, and we're also gonna do the fronts as well. I already did an inspection on the front. Notice that the fronts need to be done as well. So we'll get those changed and then we should be good to go. So while I was at work at my other job today, tree service guy called, said he had his uh, three cord dump trailer full of maple, wanted to know if I was interested. I said, sure. So he dropped that off for us. Gramps got probably, I'm gonna say a morning and a half worth, and then he'll have that finished. We're working on row number four that's stacked. He started this Monday morning. It's Wednesday right now. So he's done some cutting and some stacking and Richard and I have done some stacking. And Dave's gonna come grab his bucket loader soon and we're gonna take that to a tree job. I split a quart of the cherry out of here. I've got a very little bit of cherry left down in the bottom down there. Um, and we've got half a quart or so worth of maple. I'll split that and put it in the racks. Uh, our oil cooler is leaking again. And I'm thinking we have an issue with the cushion on our hydraulic cylinder and it's causing it to back feed. I don't know if you can see it or not. But there's a crack right beside my finger. Um, and it's leaking, but not bad. So we'll keep an eye on it. We'll keep using it best we can, but 
if you like this kind of thing guys so these are just little status updates to let you know what we're doing as the week goes right now it looks like saturday is going to be the earliest i can deliver anything um just with parts waiting on parts i'll try to see if i can get some local instead of waiting online but i'm kind of at the mercy of the part people right now so we'll see what we get but if you like this thumbs up like comment subscribe we'll see you on the next one guys keep cutting and have fun